Okay, my first uh, horse to follow will be Wame Star. He's a former Griffin from last season. Um, he was actually a, a big purchase at the Breeze Up sale. I think they top, he was a top lot at the Breeze Up sale. And he carried that through uh, for his first debut win as a Griffin. He was extremely impressive. I think if you follow Griffin's uh, form the following season, it does stand up very well. Um, he looks an exciting prospect, but I'm expecting him to go a lot higher in the ratings, and I think uh, he does look the real deal. My next one to follow is Real Specialist from the John Size Yard. He's only had a couple of starts, he's unbeaten at this stage, but he's looked very green, but what I've liked about his victories is that he still does the job very professionally with a lot of upside. His uh, most recent victory he covered a lot of ground, he came away to win well after a tough run in transit, and I think John Size has a big program lined out for this horse this year, and I'd be surprised if he didn't make it all the way to triple figures. Scarlet Carmelia, I think, from the Danny Shumyard could be a, a very good horse to follow for the season. He's uh, had only had two starts. He won, of course, impressively first up last season at big odds. And then he clearly had excuses on his seasonal reappearance. I think he's going to be a better horse when he steps up in trip. He's been kept to the shorter journeys up to this point in time. But he's got a very good turn of foot. He's got a lot of upside. He's still been a bit green up to this point in time. But he really has an engine. He's got a great turn of foot. And I think uh, if you follow Scarlet Carmelia for the season, you should at least get a few wins. He's a definitely a rising star. Eagle Regiment looks a, a very exciting prospect. He's uh, progressing very nicely through the ratings. Of course, he won first up this season, and uh, it was a superlative performance winning down the straight thousand. He's already quite high in the ratings, but the way that he won down the straight on the opening day or opening day of the season suggested that he could be a next exciting sprinter for Hong Kong. I think he's got all the credentials, and I expect him to be another rising star in the Hong Kong sprinting ranks. Please log on to the Hong Kong Jogging Club website and vote for your favourite rising star.